Hi guys, okay, so this is my first college acceptance, which I just got it from UAlbany, and I applied as a political science major, that's my major for like all my schools, and um, I actually didn't know that, uh, that the decision came out November 18th, and it's December 1st, and I had no idea. This is my decision, so let's see. And I got into you already. That's one for like 25 schools I think I applied to. I applied to a lot of schools. So yeah, I got into you already. I'm looking at Alfred University. Let's see, it's recording. Um, they said a decision has been added. So imagine it says projector. <laughs> Yeah. Welcome to your application portal. Do your update. Decision letter. <gasps> you got it? I got it. For what? But I got a scholarship for twenty six thousand a year. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alfred University. Oh my goodness! It's up. It's worth one hundred and four thousand dollars. You better take that shit. <laughs> that I got into St. Francis. I just they sent me an email. I didn't get to screen record this, but I got into St. Francis College and I got on a merit scholarship. So yeah, that was really cool. And um, yeah, so I got into St. Francis. Number three. Hi guys, so I'm in theater class with Bessie Justin and I just found out I got into another university so I'm gonna oh, St. Peter's yeah so I just found out that they said they sent me a congratulations email so that's four for four later on that day I just found out I got into Holy Cross and I got their highest um, merit scholarship which was 20k per year which is over 80,000 and yeah Hi guys, it's December 15th. I also just got a notification that I got into Notre Dame and I also got into you know, um, Oswego with a presidential scholarship. So I'm really excited and I just got into one of my reach schools. Okay, so Oswego just sent me an acceptance box in the mail. Um, sent me, let's see what this is. That's his acceptance letter. And they sent me. Oh, they sent me a beanie! This is so cute! Aww! There's a status update for my four down. I got into four down! December 15th and it's Ivy Day and I predict that Amosvi will get into Harvard. It is 3.51 and results come out in 3 hours and 9 minutes. I also got into St. John's on a scholarship. They also gave me 116k in total so I got like 29k per um, semester which I mean per year. <laughs> so yeah I thought that was pretty exciting and yeah. Okay, so Binghamton said there's been a status update on my portal. Um, and I'm really nervous because I feel like I'm going to get rejected. And that's going to be really sad. <laughs> Ugh. Mm. I got deferred. I got deferred. I got deferred. This is so annoying. I literally got deferred. How did I know? I literally felt like I was gonna get deferred, which is so annoying because ugh, that's so annoying. That's so annoying. Okay, my first like rejection slash deferral. Yeah, 
Okay. That sucks. <laughs> okay. I look a mess, but I can finally look at my admission status. <sighs> I got deferred. I got deferred. <sighs> I got deferred. I got deferred. That's annoying. Okay, fine. So a status update has been added to my Villanova, which it's just rejection. It's just rejection. Like, yep, rejection. <laughs> like, was not expecting much from that. Um. Yeah. So for Villanova. <laughs> yeah, didn't get in. Even though I thought I wrote a good supplemental, but it's fine. As you can see, I got into U Miami. Um, I was really, really shocked. I couldn't even record it because I was just so in shock. I literally, like, to be honest, I was just applied for like funsies, and I was like, okay, I'm like not gonna get in. And I loved the school a lot, and but I was like, okay, not gonna get in. But I got my acceptance letter, and I'm repping the shirt. It's all about the U. Um, my really bad U, but yeah. Sorry, I'm touching my hair. But I just haven't filmed this in forever and it's a, like April now and last time I think I filmed a video for this was like June. So yeah. So also other schools I applied to was UNC Chapel Hill, which I got rejected from because it has an 8% out of state acceptance rate. So I wasn't really expecting to get into UNC Chapel Hill, but it was kind of sad. That one like kind of shook my heart because I really loved the school and I was like, that's my school. But they were like, mm, no, it's not. So now I'm like, okay with it. I'm like really happy with it. And I'm like content. I'm like, okay, I didn't get in. It's fine. So yeah. I also got into Spelman University or Spelman College. I was like, whoa, literally insane. One of the number one HBCUs. I got into Spelman. They sent me an email. They were like, congratulations. I'll have it somewhere on the screen. Um, I was literally like, whoa, I was like, okay, in my head, I was like, can I get rejected, can I get rejected? I opened it, I seen confetti, I was like, what the fuck? I was literally like, wow, I was so shook because I honestly thought I was gonna get rejected after getting deferred from Bing and deferred from Howard and rejected from VU and yeah, so you guys kind of get the gist of that. Howard University, I also got waitlisted at it's fine because after the deferral um i got waitlisted at howard university which is fine i'm not gonna choose that school um i kind of made up my mind on that one which that one i wasn't really shocked at because i feel like deferrals i don't know it's like it's either yes or no now and like whatever but i mean i got waitlisted but i really i applied as a really competitive major um so i'm not like super like shocked about that and like upset it's not really i wasn't really planning on going to that school but I just thought for like fun you know, HBCU, I was like, let me check it out. But now I'm like, okay, like not going. I also got into Syracuse University. Just wanted to put that out there. I got into Syracuse, um, really beautiful campus, super cool. Um, yeah. So yeah, like whatever. <laughs> um, what else schools did I get into? I know I'm missing one school and I'm like trying to think about it, but yeah that was kind of like my college decisions um i hope you guys did enjoy this video this video took me literally months to make so if you can like like and subscribe that would be amazing and i can't wait to take you guys like along my college journey and it's been a really amazing journey so for anyone who hasn't like gotten into their dream college i would say just don't give up hope and like don't get upset because there's so much more and you might end up going to a school that you might have not thought you might have not liked in the beginning and then you ended up loving the school so i just think that you should always just keep having like that optimistic mindset and always look for the brighter side and things so that's what i'm doing and i'm really really excited with my college acceptances and i wouldn't have done anything differently and yeah thank you guys so much for watching this video and i hope you guys enjoyed